Hello Aries, this is Clarity1129. Welcome to your July 2021 monthly forecast. Uh, the setting is a little different and I hope it is conducive for this, conducive for this kind of reading. Alright, to begin with, here's the card uh, from the Vedic Astrology deck which talks about Aries. I'll just read it out to you quickly. Aries, Mesha, Ruler, Mars. Independent, practical, enterprising, courageous, self-centered, structured, planning, extreme and leading. Well, you are leaders, we know that, and you are also leaders of the sign. I'll put your card here. We'll, you follow the usual format. We'll first take out a card from the Moonology deck for the overarching energy of the month. And it says... Your hard work is paying off. New moon in Capricorn. That's a beautiful card to get. Where do we put this? I put this right here. Okay. Next we take out cards from the Universal Way Tarot. That's the deck we are using this month. shuffle the cards and keep and yet just before the reading I'd like to do my usual shuffling all right so first card the general energy for the month you get the eight of cups the second card is in your love sector we get the beautiful three of cups for your career and finances you get the entrance you're on a roll Aries I can just see wow and for your spiritual growth, you get the beautiful sun. It's positive all the way. Now, all we have to look at is your health sector. get the world oh that's wonderful this is a very positive reading with one glance I can tell you that much sorry about this that's my uh, lovely furry friend that we have Joey and as I can see all his hair all over the place I'm sorry about that I don't know whether it gets picked up on the camera but it's an ISO watching it on the mat everywhere yeah. All right. I mean, the fur looks lovely on him. Um, okay. The overarching energy, as I said, was your hard work is paying off, Aries. So if you've been working towards something, which is something which is Aries is always doing, you're always in action, you're always in motion, and you're the first cardinal sign, and you're the first sign of the zodiac, so you're always on the move. You've always got... A mission all right and whatever you're putting your effort into spirit is trying to tell you that it's going to pay off also the general um, energy for this month with the eight of cups says that you are walking away for some from something which also means that you're walking towards something so basically this card shows that this person's got eight cups here but he's going away in search of those two cups so that's what you're doing uh, at this time there is something on your mind you have achieved a lot but you're working towards those two cups you're leaving everything else looking for something else which is very clear in your mind and you're being told by spirit that this month you should be able to get what you're looking for for love and romance you get the beautiful three of cups so um, it means if you're single, there are chances that you will meet somebody and it could be um, that that's someone special you could meet uh, possibly at a social gathering if uh, where you live social gatherings are permitted because with the pandemic in certain pockets, um, this is still not possible. Um, but if it is, 
it's indicated that you will be uh, meeting this person whom you're going to hit it off really well with but at a social gathering basically you're going to meet this person when you are already amongst people that you know all right uh, it's also going to be a great time of those who are already partnered or in relationships is going to be a period of um, happiness you you know you're going to be you'll have reasons to celebrate and it's basically a great time so whether you're single or partnered or in um, committed relationships uh, it's a great time for you this is beautiful for your career and finances you get the empress the ultimate card for abundance of every kind uh, prosperity wealth fertility creativity beauty everything so you are on a roll with no wonder your hard work is paying off and you are going to reap uh, rewards for all the hard work you've put in for the seeds you have sown for your spiritual path you get the beautiful sun so um, you are filled with renewed energy and you and uh, you are able to at this time appreciate everything around you and it is your inner world that is so beautiful that is reflecting in your outer world right now Aries so you are in a very good place this month of July this is actually the reward you receive for all the effort you've been putting uh, in all this while so July is a wonderful month for you yeah, and uh, I'm being drawn to this child it is also possible that there is someone younger than you possibly a child either your own or someone in your vicinity who um, gets you to think deeper about certain things in life or brings clarity into something that you've been looking for all right but basically um, you are going to be the classic case of as within so without so what your inner world is will reflect in your outer world so you're at a great place even spiritually and you're realizing that you see goodness in everything and you see uh, you know um, the whole idea of collective consciousness you're aware of that at this time for your health you get the world card which basically shows that you're in good health mostly if at all you'll be trying to use anti-aging creams or something like that but uh, nothing major if you are uh, already recovering from something then you will be coming out of it without a problem so based all in all Aries this is a wonderful month for you uh, July 2021 uh, is an absolutely rocking month so uh, I just hope you have a lovely month do let me know in the comments if it has worked out this way for you now for that question on your mind if there is any pressing question for which you'd like to know an answer we shall pull out a card from the angel answers and the angels will be ready with their answers now whether you want to follow them or not is up to you but they definitely have an answer so are we ready Aries for that one question on your mind what do the angels have to say choose a new direction so this actually gets me uh, to take this card you are indeed going looking for something else so maybe you're already on one path and your angels are saying maybe you're on the wrong path and you've got to look for those two cups somewhere else or you've not yet embarked on this journey looking for those two cups and your angels are indicating that it's time to do it right now all right now uh, where do you see maximum um, where will you see uh, you know activity maximum activity in your life or changes in your life all right and for that you get happiness wow what else do you want so you are going to be at in a very happy place this month and that is visible we actually didn't need to take this card out it's really visible isn't it here and if there is a time specific question for any of you all of you uh, when is whatever you're waiting for going to happen or when are you going to travel or when is the result of something coming well the answer is july wow this very month 
so wow i wish this was an aquarius reading i'd be so delighted looking at this this is wonderful aries hmm, come to think of it i'm aries moon so maybe i have something to uh take from here uh as i've always said for uh, best results you must check your sun moon and rising signs all right anyway i'm very happy with this reading it's the first reading of this um of july i always begin with aries and it's such a wonderful way to begin all right so i hope this reading resonated with you and if it did do let me know so have a great july aries bye bye